Martin. I'm Chris, and we want to introduce you to a super smart bird. This bird is so smart, it nears the intelligence of humans. Could it be an owl? Oh, how about a hummingbird? Or an ostrich? Could it be an eagle with a mighty brain? Well, the answer is none of those, but it could be a raven. The raven is definitely one of the smartest birds. Oh, yeah, and really cool looking, too. Do you want to know how smart a raven is? Researchers have found that in using tools and solving problems, a raven is smart like a gorilla and just as smart as a young human. A raven has a great memory. She can hide food, then remember where she left it and go back and get it later. A raven can make so many different sounds. It's like ravens have their own bird language. Ravens play games alone and with each other. And ravens also play tricks on people. <laughs> Make sure you don't leave your camera gear unattended. So ravens are one of the coolest and smartest birds in the entire creature world. And they have a close relative, the crows, who share a lot of similar characteristics, but are also different in their own ways. Let's check out the differences between crows and ravens. <laughs> When most people see a black bird flying in the sky, they think it's a crow. But now you know all about ravens. So when you see a black bird, you know it could be a crow or a raven. But how do you tell the difference? That's what we're going to go over. First of all, ravens are bigger. They have heftier bodies and also broader, bigger beaks. Crows are much smaller birds. They have a more slender body and a more slender, pointy beak. And on the beak, Ravens have these long bristles called nasal bristles. You can really see them. Crows have nasal bristles, too. You hardly even notice them. Another thing is the neck feathers. Ravens have shaggy neck feathers. They're called hackles. Crows' necks are smoother. Ravens love to soar and glide. And they perform aerial acrobatics when they play together. Crows like to flap around a little more. Ravens often fly alone or in small groups. Crows can be seen in much bigger groups and sometimes sit around in trees in large numbers. And their vocalizations are different, too. As you know, ravens can make a lot of sounds, but their main sound is like a croaking sound. Crows make that classic caw, caw, caw sound. Well done. <laughs> But both crows and ravens are super smart. Yeah, they are amazing bird brains. When you're out in the wild, you're more likely to see a crow and could get lucky and spot a raven. So remember the difference between a crow and a raven and keep on creature adventuring. We'll see you on the creature trail.